such a crybaby for a boy. Hey you, sissy, girly boy. Hey, stop teasing now. What? The tomboy is coming. Run away. Shoot, they are as annoying as always. Are you alright now? Sorry, Trishti. Hmm. Why are you apologizing? Because of me, you were always teased by them. Because of those lame boys like me. No, stop saying things like that about yourself. It's not your fault, so you don't have to apologize. Besides, I don't care about any of what they said. Trishti... Fine, I'm not letting anyone hurt you. Yeah, thank you, Drishti. Noah and I were always together during childhood. He used to be teased by other boys because of his shyness and his quiet personality. I had a sense of duty to protect Noah. Who, always, who was always hitting behind my back. I just couldn't leave him alone. I enjoyed the situation. It was as if I had a little brother. Our relationship continued into elementary school. We were always together. I thought that we would always be together like best friends. After graduation, no entered a boys' middle school. We couldn't go to and we couldn't go to and from school together anymore. Because of this, our schedules no longer matched up and we gradually stopped hanging out together. When we entered the same high school, Noah's personality had come back dark and his negative vibe kept people away. Even when I tried to approach him, he seemed to avoid me. A few months passed, but we could no longer get along like we used to. One day, a chance came. <laughs> 